profit and loss using Ishima's four square. SP means selling price, CP means cost price. Whenever we are giving a four square, selling price stays here, cost price, profit, and then loss. Today we'll be looking at eight sample questions that will cover for profit and loss. Thank you. Remember Ishima's four square. SP, CP, profit, loss. That means selling price, cost price, profit, loss. Always remember to find the difference between the selling price and the cost price. If we find the difference between the selling price and the cost price, that's this minus this, we are going to get 100. 900 minus 800 will be 100. And we'll write it under 900 because 900 is bigger than 800. So we have 100 here. So all we have just done is that profit profit equals to selling price minus cost price selling price minus cost price and the same thing goes for the second one is always selling price and cost price finding the difference between the two of them but this time cost price is bigger so 800 minus 600 will give you 200 and we'll write it under the bigger value that means loss loss equals to cost price minus selling price so if you are giving the selling price and profit you also subtract okay that means 300 from minus 100 that will give you 200 and so we write our 200 in the cost price always note you cannot have profit and loss you either have a profit or you have a loss so the same thing applies here when you are giving 250 and 30 that's for cost price and loss so what do you do you also subtract so you subtract and subtract the same so if you subtract 250 minus uh, 30 we are going to get 220 and so it comes to the selling price 220 that tells us that for cost price cost price equals to selling price minus profit and for selling price equals to cost price minus loss so remember the first one we subtracted when we are giving these two we also subtracted when we are giving the selling price and the cost price and here we also subtracted when we are giving the selling price and the cost price here and uh, and the profit sorry and then we subtracted when we are giving cost price and um, loss when our question is diagonal when you are giving diagonal we always add diagonal this way so if you are giving selling price and you are giving loss we will add or if you are giving cost price and you are giving profit we also add and don't forget you cannot have profit and loss so if you add 520 and 50 together we are going to get 570 to write on the cost price and the same thing here if you add cost price and profit here you are going to have eight thousand sorry nine thousand nine thousand two hundred so that tells us that if you are looking for selling price selling price is going to be cost price plus profit and of course we have cost price is equals to selling price plus loss these are the only two times in profit and loss when we add thank you